Another easy weather day for South Florida. I'm Chief Certified Meteorologist Betty Davis. Temperatures near normal and no rainfall. It's been dry all week. Here we are now in Miami. A few clouds out there. The dew point at 71 and east wind at six miles per hour. And finally, a few showers over the Atlantic waters that look as though they may want to drift a little closer to our shoreline. So we're not going to rule out a stray shower along the east coast to kick off our Saturday morning, though our skycast model is not painting torrential downpours over Miami. I don't think we'll have it playing out that way as you're getting out the door early, say around 8 a.m. Temperature 78 to around 80 and then we'll start to rise and climb back up toward the low 90s light east winds in the morning. Here's what we see as far as weather systems over the US. There's a front stalled draped back down toward the Gulf Coast or at least just offshore of Louisiana and ahead of that front, meaning our end of the peninsula, uh, we are looking at just that better chance for a few showers and also keeping track of this trough out near the Bahamas. So between the trough and also this stalled front uh, near the panhandle and over the Gulf waters, we will see a little bit, a bit better chance for finally getting a shower to develop over the area tomorrow. Our forecast model is painting some spotty showers or storms developing over parts of Metro Broward and Dade tomorrow afternoon. And then for Sunday, we get off to a quiet start. Daytime heating could breed a few more showers popping up as well, but our weekend should not be ruined by rainfall. In case you missed the tropical update at the top of the hour, here is the very latest on Hurricane Lee, about 440 miles east of the northern Leeward Islands. Forecast track still keeps the core of it away from the islands. That northward turn expected by the middle part of next week, and the plan is for this to not be uh, a concern for us here in Florida, not our weather system to deal with. All right, check out the seven day planner. High temperatures in the low 90s this weekend, rain chance around 30%. And not too far away from what the weekend looks like next week is going to look kind of similar.